Hey, I'm Kayla. I am a solutions architect with School of Sheets and we build custom smart sheet solutions. Today I wanted to talk about my top five favorite features of the new released Table View with Smartsheet. So let's get into it. Table View is a modern replacement for Grid View and it's specifically designed for large scale projects. It features continuous saving and real time updates for anyone working in the sheet with multiple users. All right, so the first feature that is new to Table View, which as you can see here, I've just got some dummy data to kind of provide an example sheet of like what you may be utilizing Table View for. My favorite things, I'll start with updating row data, especially when you have a large sheet. If you're needing to update multiple columns of data, you may find yourself scrolling back and forth on a massive sheet. The first thing that Table View does that's really awesome is allows you to double click any row that you need to make updates to. And it gives you similar to a dynamic view or an update request like panel view where all of your fields are available in almost a form look. And you can make all of your changes without having to scroll back and forth. So I find that to be really helpful. All right, so the second feature that Table View has that I really like is that your drop down columns are now able to be colored. There's a few reasons that that can be super helpful visually if you're looking for any like trends or patterns or seeing what is coming up more. This is a great way to like easily identify what drop down has been selected. I think it's also just allows you to be more visually organized. So you can go ahead any of my drop down selection columns. I can double click those and I can edit colors for any of these drop down selections. My third might be my favorite. You're making big changes to a sheet. You've always been stuck on deleting up to five columns at a time. So if you're completely revamping a sheet and you need to delete like 30 columns, that can be a little cumbersome. That limit is finally gone with table view. You can delete multiple columns, as many as you need to at one time. The one caveat being, it is not reversible. So if you're deleting 10 columns, be sure that you really want them deleted because you cannot undo it if you delete something that you did not intend to delete. Another one that's great for like a project management spreadsheet, the in row ability to adjust your hierarchies. So rather than having to go to the top of your sheet and find that indent or outdent button, every row now has the capability to make indentation. So you can create your parent and child row a lot more easily. My fifth feature that I'm super happy with is just enhanced find and filter tools. I always found that the filter tool could have been improved, to be honest. So now it's a little bit simpler. You can add a filter. Maybe I want to filter by location. All of my drop downs are here. I can just look. And this is great for if I'm just looking up data, trying to like understand my data very quickly. But if it's something that I'm, you know, going to be looking at every day, I'm going to be pulling up this view every day. Super simple to save a filter here, give it a name, save that, and then I can always pull it back up. It's also really nice for adding to or customizing even further an existing filter where you can just do an and or. Yeah, I wanna see two different types of filters built into one. I just modified that filter very simply. Okay, the sixth and last feature that I wanted to talk about today is for anyone that's big on their formulas like I am. Like almost every sheet that I use has a formula and they've really improved the platform for building out your formulas. So I have an example here where they have a permit issued. I just created a formula here and look at that. I double click my formula column and this nice right hand field opens up, especially when you have long or complex formulas, being able to like have a nice big space to work on your formula or maybe you wrote it out and there's an error that you're not quite sure what, what's causing the error. 
get your formulas written and ready to go. You can apply it to a cell, a column, or even create a new column specifically for your formulas. So thanks for watching. If you're interested in getting any help developing, implementing, optimizing any solutions for your business, please click the link below and you can schedule a no obligation discovery call with one of our solution architects. Um, if you found this video interesting or helpful, please like and subscribe to our channel to continue learning more about Smartsheet. Thanks. Have a great day.